So I've got the room light off today because I kind of, I don't know, I'm like a, I don't know, you call it like a chill morning kind of a mood. Uh, we do have a quest complete over here, I think. Two quests. Um, do we get our bonus? Probably not. Nope, that's okay. And, <clears throat> oh, excuse me, 96% uh, chance success. And we got some player experience. How much experience do we get for this? I didn't even notice how much experience we got. Huh. Okay, and then we've got 10 empowered soul shards. We still need more of these. Let's keep going with them. Uh, Together we will destroy the burning leaf. All right, and what if we put Ritzen on here instead? I will leave yeah. cinders. Let's start mission. Okay. And then combat ally. What does Ritson do for us? I will leave All doors in the area are to provide you with the vulnerability. Can accompany you as a guardian in the broken ally? Sounds kind of fun. Let's do that. Um, I do like combat allies quite a bit, actually. And we're still working on that. And I think... We have some troops, maybe, that are trained over here? Yes, okay, we got some accolades. Sweet. Um... I am queued up for a Legion dungeon. I did, uh, we're actually in the queue for every dungeon except for Halls of Valor, since we've already done Hall of, Halls of Valor somewhat recently. And what else do we want to do? I think, what level are we? We're still 104. I think until 105 at least I want to go back to, when I think about this. I think I want to go back to where we were in Azuna. Take a balloon tour of Azuna. What's the calendar? I should look at the calendar, right? That that would tell me. Spring Balloon Festival. Ah, the Dark Moon Fair is open. Okay, how do I get to the Dark Moon Fair? I need to remember how to do this. Um. <laughs> I'm gonna Google this because I don't recall how to get to the Dark Moon Fair, and I think I think I have a sense of it. Um, how to? I think I don't need to go to Stormwind. How to get to the Dark Moon Fair? Um, phone here. This is a. I think I've talked about my phone before. It's an. I don't know how you pronounce it. Asus or Asus? I say Asus. Asus Zenfone Three Zoom. It's actually a couple year old phone now, but it was I got it for like two hundred and fifty dollars at the time. And I love this phone. It's got like a 5,000 or 5,500 milliamp hour battery. I literally charge it every maybe two days or something. Or that's all, all I need to charge it. I tend to charge it every night, but it goes easily two full days for me. It's got like, I get like 10 to 12 hours of screen time at least, which is well more than I use it. Um, so I'm going to go to the Dark Moon Fair because I have all these Dark Moon Fair quest items to drop off. Uh, and I think it's... I'm almost 100% sure. Yeah, it's a gold shard. Okay, let's do this then. Let's go to... It's actually on my hearth. Such the trade district, which is beautiful. My headless horseman's hearthstone, which is nice. It's a free bag slot. I don't have it in my bag, just a trinket item, so... Or a toy box item. <laughs> Every now and then I look over, I'm like, am I still recording? I don't know if I am, but I am, thankfully. All right, let's head to the Dark Moon Fur, which I didn't think was supposed to be today, but apparently I was wrong. So we go down here. I think it's over there. Just fly over, probably the fastest way to get there. So, um, kind of a weird last like week or two of video uploads for me. Uh, I had, this should be, let me think about this episode. This should be episode 96 of my Warlock Worgen Let's Play. And I... There's a chest over here, I'll grab that. Um, water log chest. I don't know why I'm like, a, I love grabbing chests. It's just one of those things that I... Requires level 110, what the heck? 
What enemy level 110 for that waterlogged chest? That's very interesting. Um, well, that was not what I expected to have happen from that chest. I expected it to be like some junk that I didn't really need or want. I'm stuck. Where am I going? Okay. There's a quest here, which is surprising to me. What quest is this? Battle Pet Trainer. Okay, okay. Don't particularly care or need that. Am I mistaken? I swore the Dark Moon Fair was over here. See, like... It says Dark Moon Fair is here. Wait, oh, there it is. Okay, okay. I just looked right past it. Got it. Sweet. Darkman Fairer. Wait, yeah? No? Click on it. Got it. Okay. <laughs> it's been a while. I've not, I've not been in the, the modern Darkman Fair very much. I think, um, yeah, we've got a bunch of quests to turn in. I think I, that's a really cool mount, by the way. What is that? That is a Fell Fire Hawk. That's yeah, cool. I like it. Uh, I did an episode on this guy, probably like episode 20 to 40, somewhere back in that range, I think. Uh, I did some f Dark Moon Fair stuff. Um, it, it's fun, actually. I, I really enjoy the Dark Moon Fair. It's kind of a cool little thing. I don't know if they expect to do much with it anymore in terms of adding more to it. If they change it, maybe from major content patches to major content patches, but or expansions, but I don't think they do. What does this you have there? Uh, where'd you get this crystal? They're very rare. Okay. I got a little bit of experience, like 18,000 experience and 10 Dark Moon Fair prizes. Alright, I'm gonna click through these. Because uh, I know I've got a few to turn in and I don't feel like. What's this guy I got for us? Tonk Scrap. Hmm. I'll click some Tonk Scrap. I have a feeling I'm gonna get sucked into the Dark Moon Fair. This is what always happens. I like the few times I've been here, I show up and then I get weirdly obsessed with hanging out here and find myself spending like an entire episode just Dark Moon Fairing it. Uh, how's our queue looking? We're the only one in queue. It's early. It's not even 7 a.m. on a Saturday, so I'm not holding my breath about uh, getting a group this early, but we'll see. I don't remember doing this. What, can I do? uh, what is this? Like 23 Grizzly Trophies. Do I have the uh, little book with me? I don't know if I even do. Can I help you? Have a good I'm not sure if I do. I should probably make sure I have that. Let's grab our Tonk Scraps. I wonder what um, I can get for my Dark Moon Fair tokens. If I, when I turn whatever I have. And we got a few more quests turning over here. Um, anyway, so I'm happy to get these kind of out of my quest log. I wasn't really planning on doing much with them, but just turn them in. An intriguing grimoire. Yep, yep. Done. Need a couple more scraps, and then we have this turn in over here. So, kind of a slow start to our episode, but I'm okay with it. We're actually getting a you know, reasonable amount of experience, all things considered. And this will be our last tonk scrap. Let's grab it. Alright, turn that in. And how many Dark Moon Fair tickets do I have now? I think I can check over here. 106. Cool. So I still have 110, I think, once I turn in. I get four more from this. And I don't know what I want to buy with it, but... I have 100. 100 solid number. It's got to be worth something. What you want? Ring Armor User Cycle. I get plus five Legion Mining Skill Points. A game token and a dark moon. All right, let's let's do this. Let's do this. I got a game token, so let's use our token. Up. Wait, what? I don't know what just happened. I feel like this did not work properly. Um. Okay. Alright. Am I doing this right? Yes, okay, I am. 
Okay, gotta stay in the booth counter, got it. Hmm. The most trivial of shooting games. Um, I like to recenter in case, in case he, like if it's in the middle, then I'll be in position. If it's on the sides, then I'll be closer to them at least. Looks like my time's running out. I guess the record is just to get 25. Whoops, I missed. Four, three, two, one. Can I shoot multiple times at the same thing? Um. Huh. 25 point six seconds. Interesting. Well, I didn't do that. I didn't have a quest for this anyway. That's fine. Uh, all right, where do I go to buy stuff? Maybe souvenir and toy prizes. We're gonna get out of here very shortly after this. Oops, that's not what I wanted. There we go. All right, what do we get? What do we get? I'd like a toy. I get a top hat. Increases experience and reputation by 10 in one hour. Huh. Oh, a seesaw? A whistle? Okay, so I think I want the Dark Moon Whistle. Because it's 90, and I don't have that yet. Let's grab that. Okay, and then I would like... Oh, uh, let's see what else... The seesaw was a good alternative. I was really considering that. But it's, it's cheaper, so I'll just go with this. And then let's get a Dark Moon Top Hat. Some bonus experience. I'll use that once we get out there. And then whistle. What does a whistle do? If I remember how to get to my toy box. I'm like blanking on how to get the toy box all of a sudden. Um. <laughs> Why am I forgetting this? Oh man, I'm so bad. Collections, there we go, that's what I was looking for. Toy box and whistle, what does it do? Huh, it's about what I expected, I guess. And then we'll use our hat once we get to... Oh, I have to be in the dark moon fair to use it. Does it actually stay buffed now? Like, do I still have it? I don't know, I'll find out soon. Let's go back to Dalaran. I think that was all my quests, right? I really hope so. Yes. Good. Okay. So I got some... What do we get about? We're getting 18,000 experience per turn in. I turned in five of them. So like 90,000 experience, I think. It's pretty good. Not, not bad. And now we will move on to... Azuna. How may I, help? Uh, I think this is... Yes, Illidari stands where I want to go. Okay. So, anyway, so it's kind of a weird upload week. I was getting, let me get back to that because I, this is episode, let me think of this, 97, yeah. Um, which is a lot. Like, it's, a, it's almost 100 hours, probably 90 to 100 hours of gameplay in the series so far. Um, I slash played, my played time on this character is 4 days and 10 hours, 16 minutes. So, um,. What was funny is I I took a little bit of time away in April because I was busy with family things, and especially early April. Finally got back into it late April. Only put up like one or two Worgen episodes in late April. Um, and then in May, first week or week and a half, didn't put any videos up, but I recorded a couple. And I was about to upload one on like May 9th, and I realized as I was checking to make sure they're in order because I was at the thumbnails that shows what level my character is, so I can kind of keep track that, oh, so, for also for people's sake of wanting to know what level I'm at, um, through the thumbnail, I think it's useful. And I was like, oh, this doesn't match up. I'm level 103, but my last video, I ended at 102. So how did I do from 102 to 103? Where did that come from? And I realized I had, episode 94, I had actually recorded it and made it into a video, rendered it, but never uploaded it to YouTube. But I had the next two or three episodes, two episodes ready to go on YouTube, so I had to go back and upload that, and it delayed everything back a couple days by the time I realized it, and sat down on my home computer and had time to upload. So, and it was kind of a funky mess, but it's all good now. I think we're, by the time you see this, I should have had probably like three or four videos almost in a row, day after day, I think, maybe, 
That's if, if it all went well, so we'll see. Anyway, sorry for the weird delay. So we're here with uh, Khadgar. We're going to grab the Into the Fray quest. So the Burning Legion has beaten us, but so two of the... Wait, has beaten us here, but so two of the Illidari. It looks like the Demon Hunters are holding their own, but just barely. Come, let's put that weapon of yours to use. I'll figure out our next move while you crush the Legion. So we're going to... The Illidari are about to be overrun. Speak with the lead demon hunter, uh, which I guess is this one. An unexpected surprise. This one. <laughs> Whoops. All right. Lord Illidan knows the way. The two of you are, wel are a welcome sight. We push the demons out of these ruins, but they are stronger than any we have encountered before. Your help is appreciated. If we do not crush this legion invader now, we will. They will overrun Azuna. Okay. Speak with Jason Alari if you'd like to help. Cool. So now we're gonna pick up all these quests. They've got a demon trapped here. I think I remember this area. I think it's like a yeah. I was gonna say a giant elite demon over here somewhere. I definitely remember this area. Trap a demon souls on the far and our front. Okay, we're gonna do that. Oh, no, whoops, I'm not going to do that. Did I just click and attack that guy? Huh. Huh, oh, whoops. Oh, well. I'm going to grab these quests. And, uh, run away. Before I get wrecked by all the guards. I did not mean to right-click on that guy. I, uh... I'm going to flee. I don't know how, what level the guards are. Oh, they're okay. 104 elites. They're not that bad. I almost killed that guy by just by Ritson and... Uh... Hey, there's Ritson. Just by using Ritson and my demon. Which is kind of funny. I didn't mean to cause problems for him. Alright, there we go. I was like, who is this other person attacking? This guy looks awesome. And then I was like, oh, that's, that's Ritson. I uh, <laughs> did not realize Ritson was. I, I wasn't. I forgot that I had added him. So I was like, "Oh, there's someone else here helping me kill this guy. Great." But nope, not necessary. All right. So what are we actually doing? I didn't read that last one at all. So we're gonna reignite these things. Okay. Okay. It's easy enough. Should be all pretty, pretty easy stuff here. Um, I'd like to kill these named mobs. I think it'd be kind of fun. Um, Having Ritson around is kind of cool. I uh, I really like having combat allies. I think they're fun. I think they're a simple addition, but they just add a little more diversity to your... I don't know. What's going on? I gotta deal with the Grizzly trophy. Oh, I need to kill these guys. That's right, that's right. And then I can trap the soul. I think it's how it works. Soul gem. Acquired. Okay, good. Yeah, so I... Uh, Am I getting bonus experience then for this? I think I must be. It makes a lot of sense you have to use that in uh, Dark Moon Fair, so you can't just stock up on those things. Living Felsate sample. Huh. Sweet. Are there any demons over here? Oh, there are. Nice. There's probably a lot of these demons that are just like dead nearby here that I could harvest with this. Maybe not this time, but. Um, alright. I forgot you could mine Infernals. That is not something you do in Vanilla WoW. And we are stocking up on our Grizzly Trophies though now, which is great. I guess I must have the, the book here with me somewhere. I don't know. I don't know. Okay. Got some more Demon Souls. The Demon Souls are easy to get. It's a really simple quest. It seems like I'm practically getting them um, on accident, just because there's so many demons here, just kind of the point, I guess, right? It's a demon invasion. Uh, let's grab these. Oh, Latharian's Lair. Yes, I will enter that dungeon. Nice. Come on, last DPS. Sweet. I didn't expect this to get in. I was, every time I looked up there, I saw I was the only one in the queue, or in the group, um, the pre-formed group, but, alright. 
sequel kills more of our allies. My father's ancient lair. There is still power within these rocks that should not be disturbed. I don't think I've done this instance before. Which is really exciting. Hey, someone said hi back to me. Feria. Feria. We have a demon hunter tank. It's so weird to me. Still not used to it. But I'll get there. Maybe I've done this? How? Mm, let's see. This seems... Actually, I think I've done this instance. This looks familiar. I did, I think, all the Legion instances. Now that I think about it, I'm pretty sure I did. I just AoE everything. Well, somewhat, somewhat AoE everything. There we go. Dump my trinket on there. Good stuff, good stuff. Okay, it's a big guy. These are uh, Ember Shard Scorpions. Fun. We should have two Warlocks with us. A Shaman and a... What is this? The Beans is a... A Demon Hunter, right? right. It's okay. I'm a noob, also. Been a few since I've tanked. That's what you want to hear. Eh, I haven't tanked in a while, guys. I was like, yeah, whatever. I'm terrible at this game anyway, but who am I to complain about bad tanks of all things? I, uh... Cataclysm? Sure. Um, are we gonna die in here? That'd be kind of funny. Demon fire channel. Good, good, good. Let's heal up. Cast one of these. Just another one. I guess I'm doing okay on DPS at least. I always, I'm always kind of happy when I have like a decent DPS. Um, let's let's do this. Let's loot. I want to uh, drop a soul well for these people, but I need everyone to slow down for a moment. Let's do this. There we go. Soul well right in the middle of everything. So hopefully they'll see it and grab it. We'll see if that happens. Not that health suns are that valuable, but I don't know. Like, why not? Why not? Got a thank you. Wow, this is an awesome group. Soulstone. Who do I soulstone or someone if we start dying? Everett. have been tapping into abilities they should not possess. Guess we're swimming. I don't remember doing it this way. Something to do with the latent power still lingering within these rocks. Make sure everyone has breathing. Also, this is an awesome little boss fight thing. Okay. Uh, not a boss fight thing, but you know what I mean, like a uh, intro to a boss fight, I guess I should say. It's kind of cool. So, uh, today is Saturday before Mother's Day, so, um... Nothing beats her. Happy Mother's Day to any moms out there, or expecting moms, or any of that. I think I probably have... I feel like I have a slightly above average age audience, like looking at my metrics on my... YouTube creator account, um, a creator studio thing, that I think a good majority of people, a good chunk of people are not young kids, for example, so it could be a fair amount of moms out there. Anyway, so tomorrow my wife and I are going to, or today, ooh, river rider leg grabs, was an upgrade? Modestly so, I'll take them. My wife and I are going to visit family. Neverog is awesome. No, I won't. I will find my own path and rejoin you on the other side. The Under King uses slaves to dig at the bones of my father. Hmm. He does not know the powers he meddles with. Where are you hiding your food, maggot? 
Please, you've already taken all the food we have. Search everywhere. These peasants have been hiding rations from the army. If you're not fighting, you're not eating. <laughs> if you're not fighting, you're not eating. Well, okay then. So, uh, anyway, so we're going to go visit uh, my family today and then go visit my wife's family tomorrow. Um, and as I was going to say, we're going back to our hometown, hometowns, a few different hometowns, uh, which we're excited because we haven't been there in a while. It's been quite a few months um, since we visited home, which is pretty long for us. We don't live that far away from our hometowns. So, uh, yeah, we have no real excuse to not go more, but I've just been busy recently. A lot of medical things we were saying for family members, you know, so that took up a lot of time. But we're looking forward to a family trip, or seeing family, I should say. I popped the uh, coin of many faces. If you're wondering why I look suddenly human and female, that's why. All right, let's get rid of AOE these guys. Let's do all the bees, maybe this, maybe that. All right, pretty good, pretty good. Dumped some AOE there. I think they got knocked back somehow. Oh, they jumped back. I see, I see. Not knocked back. I gotta keep, remember to use Havoc more. I've been really bad about using Havoc recently. Um, for whatever reason, I just don't use it as much as I should. Okay. Dead. I this guy was a boss, but he's not a boss. He's just a rather large dude. Uh, Vile, Sh Vile Shard Hulk. He's not the Hulk, you know, but he's a Hulk. Let's not stand that. Let's heal up. Why are we get taking so much damage? Oh, I see, I see. I'm, like, any of that stuff I'm not supposed to stand in. Oh, I tried to heal myself up. That did not work. Um, I may not to stand in the bad stuff. Oops. I, is this sand? Like, was what was hitting me? I, I really wasn't... Yeah, I don't know. I, uh, I'm still not aware of what actually was doing a lot of damage to me there. My Infernal still... Oh, no, that guy's Infernal. Not my Infernal. My Infernal died. Alright, hey. They're doing okay. Seem to have a chance. Uh, maybe? Mana's good. Does mana ever run out in five minutes? Oh, DPS is dead. We're probably toast now. Uh, maybe they'll get the Hulk down. That'd be nice. Hulk down. Okay, they're probably good, man. They probably got this. I feel like I should release and run back at that point. Because um, it's probably about as fast. Oh, we're skipping their rare spawn over there? Lame. Um... I figured I might as well just run back. I was waiting because I thought we might, I might get a res if they all lived, but then that obviously was happening. That was, that was becoming less and less likely. Turn those away from the group. Ouchie. Oh yeah, interesting. There, killing bow. Look at me. So good at this game. So maybe it was. Um, maybe it wasn't my fault. I blame the hunter. Is there a hunter in the group? There's not. Good. I didn't think there was a hunter. I remember looking back, it's like, oh no, it's a shaman, two warlocks, as far as DPS goes. But it worked, we survived. Well, we didn't survive. But we, uh, oh, I lost my 10% experience buff. That's sad. Oh, bummer. Alright, let's do this. Let's. Oh, whoops, there we go, let's drop him there. Alright. Well, we killed a little one, and now we killed a big one. This is much better, having it not facing us. <laughs> uh, the chat is great. I'm, I I love people talk and like, learn and converse about ideas. Uh, you know what I don't ever do is Shadow Fury. Does it even work on these guys? Oh, it does. Nice. It just I don't use it very much in instances for whatever reason. Um, it's kind of a nice change. I, there's a lot of things I don't use. Let's be honest, there's a lot of things in Warlock that I do not use that I should be using probably. 
Um, let's do this. Oh, I dodged it, just barely. Just barely. Alright, is that actually... So... That's right, I get it now. I'm, that's right, I think I saw several comments on this. It's just like Cataclysm and then Channel Demon Fire. Because it hits all my immolated targets. Yes. I forgot that that's how it works. Pay attention, Navarok. I want you to see your heroes die. Okay. Let's hit him with this. Hit him with one of these. I wonder if he, uh... I wonder if he casts... Or summons any allies. It doesn't seem like he's going to. Oh, nope. <laughs> there you go. Let's let's kill this probably very quickly. That'd probably be good. I'm not sure we need to kill those like ASAP or it gets out of hand quickly. It's just one of those things where I doubt it's a complicated fight. Unless you don't... Unless you don't do the mechanics. Why'd I lose target? Oh, okay. Hmm. Interesting. Bellowing idol. Let's nuke these. Okay. So far, so good. Maybe I should not stand in between that. Those hands look... Nah, very threatening, very threatening. You know, for a mechanical keyboard, I feel like my keyboard is fairly quiet. I, I specifically aimed for a uh, quiet mechanical keyboard, which I'm... And I bought it probably like October 2017, I think. It's like fall. Um, maybe September. But I'm pretty happy with it. It's like a, It's the first edition, the first round, first generation, let's say. Of the Corsair MX Strafe, I think is what it is. Um, Strife? Maybe I think it's Strafe. But I got like the red LED um, rather than the RGB because I don't care about. I didn't care about the red LED, to be honest. It's kind of useful when I play like in a dark room like this, which I don't do often. Turbax, the slug. That's funny. Slug races. Um, but, you know, I think it's pretty quiet. You can hear him for sure, you can hear the key clicks, but... This Our passage to Dark Rule will be blocked. She comes. Naraxxus will feast on your bones! I need a target. Huh. I don't know if I've seen a lot of Demon Hunter tanks. This guy's talking about he's not sold on Demon Hunter. I don't know enough to comment, really. But I'm not overly familiar with them. Naraxxus, okay. They just fancy. <laughs> yeah. They do have double jumps, which is pretty sweet. Alright, let's do uh, one of these and then one of these. Cataclysm and Demon Fire. That hits hard. I like it. As I proceed to pull aggro. No, no, no aggro pull. I thought I was pulling aggro, but I'm okay. There's so much good AoE for Warlocks. Like, I don't ever, or, I don't ever think of Warlocks as being a good AoE class, but. In modern one, I feel like they're pretty good because they've they've got depending on how you spec, I mean for sure. But it just feels like there's a lot of options for AoEing as a warlock now. That really weren't there in my opinion, but only like Hellfire and Rain of Fire. I think that was it. <laughs> I like it. I've been eating up. Eating up. Let's kill this guy. Probably shouldn't have used my Infernal that early. I'm trying to stack Soul Shards now for this, but yeah, kind of wasted my my uh, Infernal. All right, let's go. Let's go. Load off one of these, then one of these, then some of this, then one of these, then one of those. Alright, just burned through a bunch of my cooldowns. That's good. Oh, 
They do have some ads here. Okay. Or speaker devout. They seem pretty squishy. I don't know what their significance is, but it doesn't seem to do much. Let's not stand in the acid. Uh, I'm one to talk about standing and stuff. I think my I have the um, GTFO add-on, which has been wildly helpful, by the way. Uh, highly recommended. As someone that does not pay a lot of attention, honestly. Um, and I've just been lucky in this, this fight that nothing's really dumped on me. All my DPS is pretty weak, all things considered. Um, considering that I haven't really had to move much, I kind of weak DPS. Awesome. How do we do this? Oh, I see. Great. Oh, there's there we go. Okay, loot. I was like, how does this work? I couldn't remember how to fall through him. I thought he had to eat us somehow. Like we had to click on him. But no. Oh no no no! no, no. I almost. Ooh. That was really bad. I almost tab targeted the the pack back here. Um, and pull that big, big dude, which I did not want to do. Thankfully, I did not. It was almost, that was almost a really bad decision. <laughs> That's, I, I think we'd have been okay, but it was one of those moments where I would have felt like a total noob. Tab targeting, man. It's super useful, but you can, you can torch it sometimes. Uh, so, okay. I should ding, I think, after completing this instance, by the way. I think we would kill Dargrol. That'll do it. I have witnessed your deeds with pride, and I am sure you will not fail High Mountain in this final hour. It's gonna pull everything? Okay. Sounds good. I'm not gonna use my uh maybe heal up a little bit. How many mobs do we have pulled right here? It's not that many. It feels like a lot, but I think it's just they're just kind of big mobs. Um, I don't need to. I'm gonna heal up a little bit. I'm just getting kind of I've aggroed a few things, so I'm getting kind of punched up. I'm just gonna heal. Actually, that's not a good idea. Let's see this. Maybe it is a good idea. I pulled that girl off of at least a couple things there, I don't know. I probably should just target with the tanks targeting, like, uh, you know, DPS knows what they're doing. But I uh, opted for the, oh, I'm going to attack this mob over here at the beginning of the fight, even though the tank was over here tanking these guys. Because I, yeah, that was not a great decision, but mm, it's fine. Alright, what I need to really do is keep in mind my... Um, I wasn't targeting what you were hitting and pulled aggro on one. So I think that's on me. I think. I think. And I could also use Unending Resolve, which I never use, but should be using more. Um, No wipe equals win. Yeah, works for me. That's bad. Let's do this, and then I can hit this guy like this. Yeah, there we go. Okay, so far so good. I'm gonna zoom out a little bit here. So, uh, there's like this really good pizza place in my hometown. It's thin crust pizza. I love thin crust pizza. I mean, don't get me wrong, I'll eat any pizza 
except pizza that has olives on it. I don't like olives. Like one of the few foods that I just like, it really doesn't taste good to me and it's hard for me to enjoy. Don't like olives. But just about anything else I'm on board with uh, food wise. We've killed Dark Girl. The Under King. I did not ding. I thought I would. I'm just watching the cinematic or cutscene, whatever you want to call it. Dialogue. Now there are other family matters that require my attention. Farewell. I hope when next we meet, it is under more peaceful circumstances. Navarok Rog is a really cool looking model, by the way. Character model. Um That's fun. That was fun. That was, it was nice. I, I'm like happy we got to do an instance. I wasn't really sure I would get a chance to do so. Um, it's not optimistic about that, but it worked out. So, oh, oh, I was like, where are we? Oh yeah, right here. Okay, I completed that quest. Let's go do this quest. I've pulled out the panda cub, so we are now fully stacked and ready to go. Alright, let's do this, do this. Um, easy. And I've got one more over here. Let's see if I can just mount up. Uh, so I, I love all pizza. I mean, just about. The only thing I really don't like is olives on it, as I mentioned. I don't like olives in general, like green olives, black olives, like no olives. Just don't like them. They don't taste good to me. They have like even kind of a like a gross taste to me. Like it actually has a bad taste to me. Just don't like them. So I'm not about that life, I guess you could say. Raven Droth, the walrus. Oh, let's maybe kill these guys first. Um, get more grizzly trophies, which is great. But yeah, so I, I uh, am really excited because I might try and talk my wife into getting thin crust pizza with me at this place. She's okay with the place. It's not like her favorite pizza. Um, and she's not as, like, I love pizza. Like, pizza, if it was not unhealthy, I would eat pizza for every meal. Favorite food by far. Like, it's so good. I used to not have it as my favorite, but I guess I'm just like a very standard, boring American, and pizza is my favorite food now. Um, but I like thin crust. Like, cracker thin crust is the best. That kind of, cr almost like a crisp bite to it. Um, that's like the dream pizza for me. I like pretty much like cheese with uh, jalapenos or Italian peppers. Pepperoncinis, whatever you call them. That's like my dream pizza, basically cheese with hot peppers. Uh, I do like pepperoni and all this other stuff, but my really my favorite is cheese with jalapenos or Italian peppers. Um, thin crust, kind of crispy, almost flaky like a pie crust. Mm. There's a place that makes that in my hometown, which I'm going to see if maybe we'll go over there. Maybe. We'll see. Anyway. Let's turn in our quest. So, reignite the wards. Thank you, Superlock. That will give us the breathing room we need to launch our counteroffensive. Sweet. Happy I could help. These are both downgrades, so I don't really care. Death to the Legion. And we're so close to leveling. Uh, yes, already I can tell their souls are weaker than their flesh. There we go. Level 105. And assault on Violet Hole is now available for us. Spring Balloon Festival. Hmm. So let me do this. I just I, I get ready, so the next episode I'll know which ones to grab. Work with Alari the Soul Eater to compel information from the Demon Souls. Let's, <laughs> let's head to the other side of the stand. Okay. Trust I remember this one. It's kind of funky. I want to go to that hot air balloon thing. I think after this quest I want to go take a little trip up here. Sky Chariot. I think I've done that before. I think you like shoot stuff down on that quest. Maybe it's a different quest. I have this is a really what interesting quest in my opinion. We're breaking the first soul gem and releasing the demon. Um, I think she's... Oh, it's, that's this one. I thought it was this one. My bad. I thought she would do it. Nope. 
I think we start getting visions, right? Yeah. Alright, tell us everything you know, fell creature. Ah ha ha ha. We are Legion. We know you, Alari, and you, Superlock. You will be ours. Interesting. Break the next soul gem. By the way, I, I've done this on accident a few times where I get like really close to the microphone and talk closer to it, which looks really funny on here because the microphone is off to that side of the screen. And I feel like it changes my voice quite a bit when I talk closer to it like this, as opposed to talking to it like this. But I don't know if it sounds better or worse, if I should move it closer. Um, that crossed my mind a while ago and I've been meaning to bring that up. I think I understand why this is not working. Okay. Here we go. You must- yeah, here we go. We must enter the soul gem and force Arav Nal to reveal Lord Illidan's location. I thought there was something gets a little more crazy looking than this, and yes it does. Alright, we got this. I do love just like dumping cooldowns on but on like mobs, just throwing everything I have. Got him. Meet me outside the gym. Okay, how do we do that? <laughs> I wonder how far this gym world goes. I can fly. Interesting. I, I'm sure. Like, I don't know. What is this? You are in the soul gym. Okay. Yeah. I'm guessing that that buff does something to you. Having that buff on you probably limits how far away you can travel or forces the quest to finish if you just fly away. I can't remember. I've never tried, obviously. Um, neither of these are probably better. Maybe a little bit better than the Band of Ingression, but I'm just going to keep what I have, I think. I wouldn't take what Arab Nal said to heart. The Inquisitor demons are masters of misinformation. You don't suspect betrayal within the ranks, do you? The Soul Eater looks through thoughtful and grim. Oh, by the way, I didn't read it, but Ar Arav, Arav Nal says that your own order is unraveling, betrayed from within, a curse you'll bear for all eternity. Yeah. I fear we won't have all of our answers about Lord Illidan for a while. Seems true. Seems true. Alright, find Korvas Bloodthorn on Farnar at a vanquish point. Um, they took a small force to Illidari across to the of the Illidari across to Farnar. Their mission was to weaken the Legion from within. I haven't heard from them in a while. I should find and lead them. Okay. Sayana. I like it. We will wipe them out together. I hope Sayana. I don't. I, I've. I've encountered her before, it's been a while. Ritson has a cool mount also. I hope Cyana is cyan in color. That would be great. Uh, let's... So I think I'll finish up this chapter of the Illidari stand, and then I'll move to another zone. I know I'm kind of jumping all over the place. Ooh, where's one? Who goes there? Keep your hands and weapons where I can see them. Where? All right. And take me out of Stormbringer, it sounds good. Yo, she teleports, that's kind of scary. You have a little bit of distance there. Um, anyway, we're going up to the balloon, the hot balloon ride, by the way. If if I, uh, you forgot the plan already. Uh, we, I don't know what I'm looking forward to from it, I'm just not familiar with it. Got some more grizzly trophies. Oh, what is that? Uh, Valley Yaka's Weathered Hand Wraps. That would be a, apparently, a slight upgrade. Sure, why not? Cool. Don't really expect to get upgrades that often from the world spawns. Alright, so is there like a balloon over here? Or am I... Just... Yes, balloon. Got it. Sweet. What are we doing? How's this work? Ted Shoemaker. Find Daglop. Okay, dude lost his imp. We can help with that in a minute. I have a couple things I want to do, though. First of all, there is Dagger Beak, which reminds me of a mob in um, 
Reminds me of a mob in... Oh, what am I thinking of? Which? Sharp Beak? I'm thinking of Sharp Beak. Sharp Beak, which is in... God, what zone is Sharp Beak in? I'm having a hard time remembering. I want to say... I want to say... Sharp Beak. Maybe it'll jog my memory if I kind of look around here a bit. I want to say Sharp Beak is in Ashenvale. Is that right? I'm not sure, but I feel like it might be in Ashenvale. Sharp Beak. Uh, is that right? No, that doesn't sound right. It feels wrong. Like the wrong spot. Alright, what do these guys got? Uh, happy balloon day. Interested in balloon ride? Yes. A balloon will leave once we have three riders ready. Oh. Go, go. On your way. Well, I'm guessing that does not happen without having... <laughs> I need to have friends. That's okay. Um, the missing demon's all the way over there. Why is the demon way over there? That's okay. Anyway, so no balloon rides today, folks. I uh, need to find a couple buddies to go with me for the balloon ride. Hmm. I'm on a like a low or medium population server, Corona, uh, US. It was a PVE realm, now it's just, you know, a regular realm. Um, so i got war mode enabled. I've had war, mo war mode enabled the entire time since BFA came out, which has been pretty handy for the extra experience, I guess. And has very rarely impacted me in terms of PvP. Like, it, I think I was killed once, maybe, this whole time. Corvas, a blood thorn. Oh, stretch. A friend, it would seem. Kane did not think we could handle this. He might have been right this time. Oh. Bonus objective. Lead the fight against the Legion. Okay, hold still. Uh, free six demon hunters. From Soul Harvesters, okay. And saving Stella Gosa. During the fighting of all things, I saw a blue drake swoop in and attack the demons. I couldn't believe my eyes. I'd heard what the I'd heard that the blue dragonfly had gone extinct. The Legion managed to bring the Drake down, but not until after she killed a score of them. She was magnificent until last I saw they were dragging her in the direction of the southern camp. We should see if she's alive. A dragon could prove powerful ally. Okay, sweet. So Okay, so let's go free some demon hunters to start. And then we're gonna kill a bunch of. Oh, this works. Okay. And then we're gonna kill a bunch of everything out here. And this will also give me a few percent on that. Okay, cool. We just whack this to destroy it because my staff is all powerful. Oh, that actually gives me... Okay, I thought that was a part of the Demon Hunter freeing. I thought this was a like a prison. Nope, that is just literally... There's the uh, add-on I was mentioning. Oh, you know what? I'm an idiot. I haven't had my Voidwalker out since we've zoned out of the instance. Which we haven't really done that much. Um, but I just forgot to swap back. We are all that stands. I'm so good at just punching things. Good job. Good job. Good man. Alright. Let us continue to free demons. I'm going to wrap up after this quest and maybe the blue drake quest. I might... Yeah, maybe let's do both those quests and then call it a day. Any bad guys in here? Oh yeah. Inquisitor. Okay. Can I mount up in here? Nope, not outside. They did things to me. Ooh, imp mother. Imp mother. Apparently, quest mob. Hmm. Let's get him. Get her. It. I think her. Is accurate. I said, did she summon demons? I didn't see any demons coming, but that's okay. Doesn't matter to me, we're gonna take her down either way. I was thinking she might summon lots of little guys, but it doesn't seem like she's summoning very many, which is for the best, probably. Alright, is that a. Okay. I think I just got a huge boost on this 
retake Farinar quest for killing her. I don't know how much that was. I think it was like 20%. I don't think we were very high. Seems significant. Alright, where's more? It's not really what I need in. I, oh, <laughs> it's got a weird pathing there. That's funny. What does that book do? Damage was deemed increased by 20%. Oh, sweet. Okay, so that is actually more than just a... Like, there is some purpose to it, besides just, uh... Sorry, I'm like, nothing shit. There is some purpose to it, besides just getting the 2% bonus for, uh, my chain quest here. Alright. Now, what, am I in combat because I... Yeah, maybe... Grifferman. Huh. Interesting. Okay. Now we're still looking for. There we go, more Illidari. And destroy. We got two more? Okay, two more. These guys are not what I need, but they're kind of. I, you know, they're good for my bonus quest. Bonus objective, so I think I get like three per that three percent. Not bad, not bad. But I'm going out of the way of my actual quest here. Let's go find our things. I've got so many things flying with me, so I can't even see. Is it like like, like my screen is all flying mobs and I'm having trouble finding uh, ground? I should just zoom in. There we go. this. <laughs> yeah, seriously, I was like, why am I having trouble finding things? And I realized my screen's literally just blocked by this. Uh, which is kind of funny. Okay. There's a few more. Let's grab this. I think it's 5% for these. Yeah, 5%. That's pretty solid. And where are my... I need to free some people. I need to find some people to free. Well, I'll at least go grab this. Okay. I only need one more. I, I must be missing. It must be like in a cave or something. I need to zoom in. I literally can't see around my compadres. There we go. That's a work. It was actually making it difficult to spot things on the ground because of all the flying mounts. Okay. Fell machinations. Alright, I've always had my doubts about Sayana. Something was never quite right there. It looks like she cracked and joined the Legion. Yep. Got some things to kill. And then, who do you have here? Blurg? Blurg. Oh, I'll kill Blurg. I don't know where Grimthick went. We lost him. He's down here running around in circles, looks like. Poor Grimthick. There he goes. Good job. Found him. Alright. Um, sure. Once we kill Blurg, which by the way, I should just grab this. Oh, I'm getting interrupted. Never mind. Not gonna do that. I mean, now I can do it. There we go. Get our 2% bonus damage against demons. Why not? Once we kill Blurg, we'll go down and find our blue Drake. And then I think. Oh, we got our bonus objective done too. Nice, nice. That did it. Sweet. Another. Oh, what's over here? Cache of Infernals? That sounds fun. I don't know if I should have done that. Oh, jeez. Okay. It's kind of cool. Just aggro all the Infernals in. Get in some more Grizzly Trophies. Sure. It's at the end of this quest, or is there like a giant Infernal that pops out? Or not quest, but of this rare spawn? Does not seem to be the end. 
They do a lot of AoE damage, sort of, although they seem to be absorbing it pretty well. Uh, just my shield, so I don't think they're doing that much damage. No, they're not doing much. They're kind of pushovers. Now we get a big one, right? Yes, Infernal Lord. Very cool. Almost dead. What does he drop for us? Order resources. Yeah, not bad. All right, now that's it. No stops. Let's go get our traders overlook. Interesting. Let's go get our Stella Gosa. There she is, coming in hot. Quickly, we have to find. Light kills key. I think I remember this. I just took a lot of damage from falling. I think. That's this guy, right? Overseer, like kill. Yeah, there we go. Um, yes. Overseer, like kill. It sounds like, uh, I don't know why the third thing comes to mind is Lysol. Oh, uh, 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 get out of that. Okay. Lysol comes to mind, which I'm sure it's not related to Lysol whatsoever. But like he'll get the key. Let's get over there and free that I forget what Lysol is even Lysol was named after someone, I think. Like the Lysol is a brand of cleaner, at least in the US. I don't know if it's really known outside the US. Um, but I think the Lysol name is named after a scientist or someone that invented some property of Lysol like in the eighteen eighties or something, like a long time ago, over a hundred years ago. Um, I think that's the origin of Lysol. Can't remember the person's name, which is unfortunate. All right. Now I'm going to finish off the warden. Oof. <laughs> Whoop. There's a remnant of the blue dragonflight nearby. We should do whatever we can to ally ourselves with them. Yep. Sounds good to me. Uh. Neither of these are probably upgrades for me. Nah, not really. Thank you, you're welcome. I'm not going to kill Nightglaive the traitor. Okay, I'm not going to let Cordana Felsong get away with this. There's no way in hell I'm going to let the Warden Witch turn my people. As for Nightglaive, I will not suffer a traitor to live. Remember, are you with me? To find Gosa, sure. Meet just... me up at the Overlook. We will finish this business together. Flying makes this so much more... Do your best. Nightglaive has been undergoing some Easy. changes. I would say. We are ready for you. Um, I mean really like flying changes it significantly. So what now? Isn't like am I Is it to meet her somewhere else? There we go, maybe I just got here too fast. Oh. Prove yourself. I have other matters to attend to. Yes, my mistress. Alright, well, someone's about to get nuked. Anyway, I don't really think we need a lot of help with this fight. I am more powerful than all of you! Like, I think I got this. <laughs> I think we're good, but sure bring in Blue Dragon Flight. GG. Let's ride back. Right. Sounds fun. Take the ride. So, we're gonna ride back. We'll turn in our quest. This might be the end of this chapter. Maybe? I don't know. It might be behind the Legion lines. It's true. Legion has stacks of demons. Like, seriously, how many demons are in the Legion's army? But after this, no matter what, I'm going to head back to Dalaran and turn in a couple quests there. We've got the Living Fell Slates type stuff, the, the mining ones, and then call it a day. Let's see what's going on story time. 
Azeroth must not fall. Choose a reward. Do any of these matter? I always forget this, how this works now. Azuna was once the center of magic research. I mean, I... A fell artifact would be nice, I guess. So what is this? 144 for fire, 141 for fell. Fire one. So I think... I think... Either of these would be ideal? I don't know. Doesn't, I think it matters much. Uh, grim news indeed. We cannot afford the loss of even one demon hunter, but you and Corvass were top were right to put an end to Nightglaive. More importantly, you have made a good friend in Stelagosa. The remnant of the blue dragonfly could prove to be a powerful ally. Behind Legion lines, we're done. Sweet. Uh, speak with Archmage Khadgar at the Azerwing Repose. For now, the Illidari can hold the line against the Legion. We will return later to help them drive the Legion from the upper reaches of Farinar. You and I must concentrate on the Pillars of Creation if the Tomb of Sargeras is to be resealed. Your saving of Selagosa is fortuitous. Surely, if anyone knows where Pillar of Creation is, it will be her grandfather. Or it will be her grandfather, Senegos. The Azerwing Repose is the Northeast. I'll meet Farewell, you there. My friend. Do not linger here too long. The Legion is attacking everywhere. I am certain that if anyone yeah. can help you find this pillar of creation, sure. it will be my Slight upgrade, why not? Let's go. You up there. You will find repose up the road to the northeast. See you soon, Kedgar. Let's go to Dalaran. We're also 105, which means we can now get another tier on our skills for our um Legion stuff. <laughs> Artifact stuff. Let's go turn in these quests. Go to our Little warlock hidey hole. And, uh. Where are these turn in at? Up here. Got it. Is this the rogue? No, it's not the rogue stuff. Alright. Turning in some fell slate samples. Laystone samples. Gain 36,000 experience. We've gained a lot of experience. We almost hit, like, a, literally a full level this episode. We went from being mostly done with one level to. Well, also done with another. Ooh, the artifact weapon. Maybe that's what I'll do next time. I did want to do more of that because I find them a lot of fun. I really enjoy the artifact weapon quest lines. Um, but. Oops. I, need to, I was going to the violet hole. I need to go to the violet citadel. There's probably a second entrance somewhere for this that I'm unaware of. I know the rogue has two or three entrances. I forget how many now, but multiple entrances. Um. But for us, the only one I know of is this portal, so I need to shave. I'm going to shave today for uh, Mother's Day weekend stuff. Alright, so what I was going to do... Oh, a mission's complete. Sweet. The Rat King, 100%. Um, I thought it was a four-hour mission. Maybe it was not. Alright, ten more empowered soul shards. We have twenty now. There are no more... Soul Shard quests. So let's do a. Let's do a follower mission quest. Together we will destroy the burning Let them level up. And then what I need to do is speak to. Who is this? I gotta remember who this person is. Which one I need to talk to? I don't think it's here. I think it's this guy over in this little spot. I think it's... None of these people look like the one I'm looking for. Black Harvest Quartermaster, I guess I can vendor off a few things here. I know I can auto-do this, but I feel like manually clicking for fun this time. And then all of these things, keep my... Yeah, keep that. Okay, maybe it's over here. Yeah, this looks... this looks... Grab my imps, which I forgot about. I'm not seeing what I'm looking for. I'm looking for the person that lets you, you know, eventually be able to have two... Art of... two legendary weapons at the same time. But these are just recruiters. I, I know there's someone, I'm, I'm just, I'm so, I always get so mixed up in here. I feel like if I saw the person, I would know. This is who I'm looking for, I 
No, it's not right. Oh, it is. It is. Okay. Grants you access to the Ritual of Doom, allowing you and four compatriots to summon mighty demons in search of empowering magics. And okay. And it was just something really. Um. I don't know what that is. Let's try it. And then after that, everything's one ten, which is super unfortunate. Uh. Okay. Anyway. Uh, we're done for today. So next time, I think I might work on the artifact weapon. To Duskwood. Sounds kind of fun. Whoops, that's not what I wanted to do. Oh, now this, this mission's here now. Dang it. I didn't see that last time. I swear that wasn't there. That's fine. I'll hang here, because next time we'll do this as we come in, and then we'll work on the artifact weapon, I think. Anyway, that's all for today. Thank you guys for watching. I hope you enjoyed it, and I'll see you next time.